Rainy day, rainy day. And I see him so the runs are rain. Yes, my viewers and subscribers. Welcome back, welcome back to another video. Just want to talk to you guys a little bit about this second and final test match between West Indies and South Africa. And I must say that things are not going in our favor at all. Runs, runs, runs and just more runs all over the place, left, right and center. The South Africans, they are scoring runs, my peeps. 287 for 7 at the close of um, today's play, leading by 356 runs. Yes, my peeps, 356 runs they are leading by. So even though our bowlers would have tried um, their best to, to make some, well, they made some early breakthrough, uh, the South African captain, Temba Bavuma, he has proven to be very, very difficult. So go and talk about it. Uh, just hit that subscribe button while you are there. If you have not yet subscribed. And I'm um, going to make my way through 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 this um, today's play. So at the close of, play, of today's play, as I said, 287 for 7. South Africa batting in the second innings. And that's a lead of 356 runs. Now, I don't know. I don't know what to tell you, my peeps. I don't know what to tell you because I was looking at it. You know, I I got the I got the opportunity to watch a good amount of it this morning, and um, our bowling, our bowling, they did okay in the first part. But you know, especially leading up to tea and after tea, we really lost the plot. And talking about most of the bowlers, you know, I can understand Alzaro was trying to bowl fast. And he was trying to bow some shorter stuff to get um to try and break the part and um, break a partnership. And he did that. Got out, got rid of one of the batsmen. I don't remember who it was. I think he was on 42 or something like that. Got him out. Even though it cost him a lot, um, cost him some runs. But generally speaking, it, it, it wasn't it wasn't too good. But if I look if you if you should look at it still in you know, my viewers and subscribers, Bowling out, um, getting South Africa for 300 and, and, and what, 20 and have them to 287 for 7. It's not the worst thing in the world, you know, as much as how we, the bowling was sloppy. It's just that the batting is not doing its job. The first innings, they tried a little thing, made 251. But the fact that they, they you know, South Africa had such a good lead, they, they, they were able to, to, cap, to, 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 to add that um, to that um, 287 and now leading by over 356 runs. Boy, I don't know. I don't know how we're going to work it out, my peeps. Man, them, um, man, them make Tem Temba Bavuma look like a genius out there, boy. You understand? And one thing with somebody like a Temba Bavuma, if he's batting for long, he's going to score runs. He's a man that, that, that plays on the front foot. Don't want to say similar to Jermaine Blackwood, you know, but he's, he's the same sort of free-flowing player. You understand? Technique is, a, is, is, is a, probably a little better, but um, he's a man like this. If he's at the crease, for any extended period of time, he's going to score runs. And the West Indies team, they have found that out. Um, he's actually on 171. We're 171, not out. Um, in terms of the bowling for us, Alzari Joseph has 2 for 49. Kyle Mears, 2 for what, what's that? Um, 25 or something like that, or 45. So Kyle Mears had, has 2 wickets. Um, Joseph has 2 wickets. Uh, the other guys, they have actually picked up a wicket apiece, a wicket apiece. Roach has one, Hola has one, Reefer has one. And as I said, the bowling didn't, we started off okay. Um, South Africa, they were 6 for 1, 8 for 2, 32 for 3, 69 for 4. And then from 69 for 4 all the way up to 103 for 5. And that is where the part, the, 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 the situation, that is where the partnership came, started my piece. Then Baba Voma came and he decided to drop anchor. Then it was um, from 103 for 5, they made uh, it all the way up to 206 for 6. Then 277 for 7, right? 287 for 7 and that is where we you know 2 277 is where we took the last wicket and there are now 287 so as i said um some good batting from south africa i don't want it to seem as if 
I'm not giving props to the guys for playing their, their, their shots and, and, and playing. It's, it's not like West Indies wrap up everything in, 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 in gift cloth and give to them. But, you know, some wayward bowling out there, man. Roach, um, I saw some wayward bowling from Roach Hola. The guys were just comfortable on the front foot, just driving. They were comfortable on the back foot. You understand? Um, too many runs, too many runs, definitely too many runs. As I said earlier, Alzari Joseph, he tried. Um, Alzari, Joseph, Alzari Joseph bowled, especially right after T. After tea time, he was bowling fast. He had a little spell there, hunting for wickets, but it cost him. You understand? It definitely cost him. And as a result of that, we are we 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 they, they already have over 300 runs, 356 runs. Don't know we're going to manage it, my viewers and subscribers. We are already we are already um I think they are already past what we are. I don't want to say capable of making, but what we would have proven that we are comfortable scoring. So. Um, just gonna have to continue to keep an eye on this game. The batsmen will have to turn up. Uh, the top order, they haven't done anything so far. In, so far, first innings, they didn't do anything. It was Jason Hola and that got 81 and a couple of guys that got in the 20s that really, you know, put things together for us. So, we, we're gonna have to, we're gonna have to make sure that we hold things tight, my peeps. Definitely gonna have to hold things tight. Um, to, 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 I don't know if we can stuck out for a draw. Based on how things looking, we, we're not going. We probably not going to win this game. I don't see us batting second innings and scoring. Um, so scoring. South Africa probably going to come back and bat a little bit, but I don't see us scoring 300 and and and, and 50 runs. I, I I can't see it. You know, I I'm not talking down to the team or saying that they are not good, but you know, you watch a game and and you want the team to win, but at the same time you're watching cricket and you you have to be realistic. You understand things can happen and I am hoping that it happens and they prove me happen and they prove me wrong. But that is where we are at my peeps. South Africa batting a second time. 287 for 7. That's a lead of over 350 had run. 356. Alzari Joseph and Kyle Mirrors getting a couple of wickets. Roach and Holder and Reefa um getting you know a wicket to their name. But um in terms of of of, of us um being in this game, I'm not too sure if we are if we are if we are in this game um right now because you're rough, you're rough my peeps. That's all I can say. You understand? Um there's not much to say um where this is concerned. Uh I can't wait for the next live show that we that 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 we are going to do. You no know, quite a few of you guys will have you have a lot to say about um the team. People will be ready to drop people, you know. Some man didn't did not perform against Zimbabwe. And so far they haven't performed against South Africa, you know, so people going, going ready to throw people out So going to be interesting my peeps, but you know, we still have a set, we still have another innings to bat So let us see how the batsmen will do before you start casting the judgment So big up on yourself and we we'll touch base later on, Zane